Friday. Don't work tomorrow. But I'm going in actually for a few hours because it's my meat manager's last day. He got promoted. Good for him. Congrats, Daniel. So I'm going to go buy, buy the whole team coffee, some donuts. I wish him good luck. Even though I've only worked with the, the young fella for like six weeks, I uh, wish him the best. And I genuinely am, genuinely am happy for him. I hope he does hope he does well and actually you know what's crazy is he's actually going to be at the store down the street from me so i'll probably be seeing him more often than he'll probably care to to want today I haven't really flown it much and the weather's nice outside so maybe I'll actually get to fly this motherfucker today so back at the old place I'm looking for a few things I told you guys about I think I told you guys in the last vlog about Jess's Jordans not being where we had left them hold on am I wrong I might be wrong. No, oh, we got our J's in here. It doesn't appear that I found my belt. It kind of weirds me out because I had it, so I don't know. So now I absolutely don't know where my belt is. So I think I'm gonna come in here, completely gut this, and get the remaining shit out of here that we're supposed to get out of here so that I can get my last month's rent. Because as soon as they told me that, I was gonna hold out on the place for two months and just prolong it. As soon as they're like, nah, you'll get your rent back, I'm like, your last month's rent back, I'm like, all right, done deal. Let's get this shit out of here now. Seems like they made my mom's tea wrong. Like, look at that. Look how much milk is in that. I said one milk. This is the shit I hate about this season. Bugs, bugs. I try to put the camera down on like a project car that my brother's working on. There's just bugs, bugs everywhere. So I just had a little fight with the drone was actually so much fun. I'll show you guys the clip here. It's nothing special, it's just over by my mom's house. I always get paranoid about flying it out and about because, well, I don't fly it often enough. a lot better than it did before. Face in this way. This way. <laughs> the bowl, like his paws are like this and the bowl's in the middle. Yeah. And he was like. Oh, he's fine. He's like. So, Tyson had me up. Fucking early man, kick sturdy to walk him. Now look at him, he's he's just chilling. I'm trying to do the same. It's like 8.30, so I still got like, I got like three hours, three and a half hours to relax. So that should be enough. And then Jess and Tyson go to the cottage tomorrow. I will join them for like a day in a bit after work on Thursday, so. That should be, that should be fun. I'm excited about that. What's up guys, good morning. So Tyson and Jess are leaving for the cottage this morning. I have to drive them to a friend's house. They will be taken from there. Tyson's a little sad though, because Jess, Jess is out running a few last minute errands. And he's just, he's sad. He's sad. <laughs> Come here, Ty. Come here, please. Yeah, he doesn't, but as soon as Jess comes in, he be <laughs> So we do this where we like wet his food to make it soft, so he doesn't have trouble digesting it. And then I'll throw 
a little bit of chicken on top so that he has something other than just kibble. Luckily this water here from the tap gets so hot this doesn't take long to soften but you just kind of got to swindle it around like that so that you make sure that it you know gets to every bit of the food. <laughs> Tyson's acting up a little bit. Ty, what's wrong? Say good morning. Don't touch my shoes, you know better. You guys like my hairdo? I actually got about seven hours of sleep. I didn't go to bed till like three. I'm awake now. So I just walked him, fed him breakfast. As you can hear, he's whining in the background. How crazy do I look right now? This is a fantastic look for me. <laughs> Dislocated paw. cut them in the center like bread so I wanted to show you guys because I bought so I took my mom to Sereno they didn't really have much that she would like and they didn't even have donuts that I can get her but the one thing they did have was not an Oreo donut but Oreo cheesecake and this shit looks amazing hopefully you guys can see it uh, they put like a weird uh, wrapper on them so I can take this shit off oh look at that how good does that look oh wow Good morning. It's Sunday. It's the end of the week. I have to work today again, but I decided to sleep in. I was like, yes, I'm like, I'm going to go in at six, write the order. And I'm like, I was sleeping. And when I fucked up my back yesterday and my shoulder, I just finally got comfortable around like 4 a.m., 3 or 4 a.m. So I was like, I'm going to continue to sleep until like 5.45. Just try to get that extra rest. My arm still hurts. But because of that, I'm going in a little later. Be there by like 6.45-ish. Looks like it's gonna be a beautiful day today. And I don't have to work till 12. Oh, oh, still got trouble getting into the car. Yesterday, I really struggled getting into the car. Getting in and out was painful, but I feel a lot better today, so that's really good, actually. So I'm pretty sure I just walked by a guy who's gonna try to steal some meat in my store. And now I'm watching a guy who's pulling up. I'm pretty sure this guy's just gonna piss in the corner. Welcome to Gerard Square. Today has been the day from hell. The day from hell. All right, so I got my trainees all set up today. Uh, Schumann's there with them. Jess is back from uh, the cottage, so I'm gonna go pick her up. I gotta stop at Costco as well. So I called Jess to check up to see if, you know, if she wants me to pick them up first or if she wanted me to basically go to Costco first. I could tell she's kind of like had her fill. She wants a break. She goes to me, she pulls it, she goes, oh, Tyson wants to see you. Tyson don't want to see me. He didn't want to see me when I was there. But I don't blame her. Like, you know, she took him for literally like five days. So, I mean, she probably, with all due respect, is like, all right, I've had my fill of this dog. I just want to have some help.
So we took Tyson down to see Winston. And they got along pretty well, but he didn't burn out as much energy as we thought he was going to. So we're going to take him and maybe walk him around. Maybe I do my power walk with him a couple times around the track. Hopefully tire him out. And then we're going to go home. Thank you.